What's going on, everybody? So, I am back at my buddy Todd's hunting camp. We're not pig hunting, we're not deer hunting, we're gator hunting. So Todd's nephew got a tag, and uh, we're hoping to go out and fill one. Dead in the door, now, buddy. <laughs> What's up, ribeye? Hmm. I got mud on my truck. Doesn't taste like mud though. Huh. Welcome to camp. Here, Mr. Redman. Hold that. You got him. I just you don't, do I don't want to hurt him. If I get no, bit, it's my own fault. You ain't hurt him. Even if he bites you, it won't hurt no, him. No, he's just bleed a little teeth. bit. Look at him he wiggling his tail. Even, yeah. Trying to make me think he's a rattler. These racers are fast. He's about 90 degrees too, so he's all warmed oh, up. Oh yeah, you got him now though. You got him. Yes, yeah, they do have the white throat. Oh yeah, he's got a white belly. Hmm. Well, if we don't get a gator, no? No? Alright. What's up, fella? They are cool, man. It always bothers me when people go out and kill them like they're bad. I it's know. the best thing you can have in Absolutely. your yard. Absolutely. Yeah, I got a buddy, I got a buddy that will kill any snake he sees. King, snake, he don't care. I've caught Eastern Rattler, Pygmies. Western Diamondbacks, I like catching that stuff. Yeah. But I'm a little off my game, so. Oh yeah. Look who's here. Look who just showed up. What's up, guys? You just had a charger today. Killed it. Even with all the red tide stuff. Yeah, did you kill it? Did good. Did bunch you? of bunch of big red fish and snook. And so I think we got the hog slayer. Yep. We got Wild Bill, the hog slayer. Oh, it's wild. Oh, Bill's got a story to tell. So, uh, I'm, I'm gonna go over here while you guys just don't hit them hard. So, uh, it's happened to me. It's not Bill's fault. Matter of fact, my crossbow is sitting in the garage. I've put limbs on it time and time again. Look at this. I've had a couple different crossbows and the limbs break sitting in the tree you got it loaded ready to go and all of a sudden you hear a crunch 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 and you're like what is that noise and you look and which can be pretty dangerous this is todd's old boat that he cut his teeth on good looking boat 23 foot hey let's head to the lake see if we can find a gator but first i need to talk to this cow here's my best imitation Y'all know what he's thinking right now? Like, how did that cow afford that truck? Did I call you beef jerk? Sound good? One thing I learned, when you got kids, don't give your cows that you're planning on eating cute little names like Charlie. Oh, poor Ellie. She, uh, a little traumatized. Until she had her first bite and she was like, Charlie tastes pretty good. Oh, what's up, T-Bone? You're almost white. Is that your cousin Porterhouse behind you? I don't know, man. I'm just saying there. Hopefully we get a catch portion of this video. There probably won't be a cooking portion, but we're not sure yet. But there is definitely going to be a cleaning portion. Talk about getting crapped on. Yeah. <laughs> <laughs> 
find him yet? Yeah, we already got him. We're getting ready to pull the boat out. Oh, awesome. Perfect. Now somebody lost their wallet. I it wasn't me. Found it. Found it. That's okay, guys. I lost my wallet about four months ago, and my wife just found it yesterday. And surprisingly, I was still missing all the cash, but she did go shopping. So Ray, I know you're only in your what, late 40s, but how long you been gator hunting? Uh, let's think, the first I'll time I went gator hunting, I was nine grass. years old, so that yeah. would have been in 1953. Oh my goodness. <laughs> they there did it I different back something. then, didn't they? Oh yeah, way I can't tell what it is, but there is something up there. My daddy, I was raised on a small farm right on the bottom of Lake Okeechobee. And uh, all the canals in the, in the sugar cane industry were for the gator. And uh, we, you know, we saw it up from the time I was, like I say, I was about nine years old the first time I went. And I've been, I love gator hunting ever since. Yeah, I bet. Hadn't gone in a lot of years. So this is Clay. And his dad, Chris. You know, guys, I, I don't know what my role is going to be here tonight, but I was I was hoping maybe I could be the navigator. <laughs> that's good. That's good. Oh, was that good? Yeah, we'll see you later, alligator. <laughs> yeah, after a while. <laughs> no, nah, it doesn't work in this case. <laughs> so you got two tags, so you're hoping to get one tonight, and then next weekend you're going back out, that's right? That's the plan. That's awesome. Hey, what's that? You see it right off the point there, right off the island? Yeah, he's not there now. You got that one right there, and you got that one over there. Yep. Reel that one in. I think I can even see the big one. Yeah. Beef long. So that wooden dowel goes down, and when they close their flap, gets stuck down in there. So then you want to get a hook in them as fast as you can. All right, so the thought process behind that is boats drive by them all the time. So basically, we know where he's at, drive by, you drop the bait in the water, and you get past him, and then uh, hopefully he comes back up and eats it. So now it's just a waiting game. He, he just surfaced down in the middle. He's about where we just dropped our bait. Oh, I see him now. He just went down underneath the water, right at the bait. So we just threw in here. Todd had his brand new big old weighted treble hook on there and the gator escaped us and we gotta get that back. He wasn't that big, was he? No. No. Alright, well we're good. How's that bottom feel? Pretty tell soft, us. huh? Oh, hold on to the boat. Oh, there's the gator. He just stepped on it. <laughs> Where's it at, brother? It'll be right in here somewhere. Bottom of those, one That's of those. What they usually do is go to the damn bottom and hook in some of that stuff. There it is. Look at you. Get it? <laughs> <laughs> well, I caught something anyway. <laughs> All right, guys. Well, we struck out. So we're fast forwarding a week. It's so now a week later. We're back out here. No, no, it's a lily pad. So, very windy today, so we're going to try and get out of the wind and see if we can find one of these bigger ones. Uh, we saw some nice ones last week, but unfortunately, uh, we couldn't get them to take the bait. So, trying a few different strategies today, see what happens. Yeah. 
Ready, Clay? Oh, yeah. Get this one. done. He is swimming away with it. Don't want him to feel you if you can help it. So they've got to get it past their flap and get it down inside of that wooden towel. Stay put. All right, guys. Been a lot of work trying to get this one bite. feeding them. Oh, he's on the bottom. He's on the bottom. He's just carrying it away. Yeah, he's definitely there. Just don't yank hard, just in case he's still got it in his mouth. I'm pretty sure he swallowed it. Alright guys, it's about to get serious. bait does not have a hook in it. I'm sure most of you know that, but it couldn't be more beautiful. My goodness, look at all the cypress. Fish all around the boat. That's where he set the hook. Get down, down in the water, all the way in the water. Good job, brother. He felt that hook. It looks like he's stopping right there. All right, 
top of the cord. Ten foot long cord. I believe he's facing this way. There we go. You hit him. Tip in the water, tip in the water, all the way down. There you go, brother. You're getting pretty good at that. Uh -huh. <laughs> yep, just take your time. As long as you stay focused, you know what we gotta do. That's it. We gotta get up. We gotta take some time. We can't force them in there. It ain't nope. get in a two, two minute wrestling match. If you keep working for about a half an hour, he's gotta come up and get the last. <laughs> right, he's gotta come up. Hour one to one. I know we might get a weekend, but. No, no, we just, yeah. yeah. But we also wanna get him in the boat. <laughs> we, we also wanna get a hook in him. <laughs> exactly. Let's just try to get you untangled. I think he's right, it's a log. Just get past him. He's right there. I'm gonna switch over to the treble with the rope on it. See if that'll keep that hook from jumping up. Got him that time, baby. Got him that time. Hey. Good job, brother. Let's get this sucker. Yeah, we want to get him in the... Alright, so we got to get hooked back in. So he's a pretty small one, but... He's got two tags. This is the last day until I think October. I can't remember exactly. So. Don't grab one. Okay. Just raise him up. Stick him in the back. Get him. Got him that time. Right, right, right in the, the back. back. All right. Wicked tuna ain't got nothing on you, bro. <laughs> <laughs> right, here. He just came up like 30 seconds ago for his first breath this whole time. Dude, if someone wants to grab this rod, I'll get this get my... bank stick ready. I got, the, I got the rod, you get the bank stick. There he is, little guy. All right, we're, we're tangled up here. That's all right. That's fine. All right, Clay, come on, Clay. You... Take your time, brother. This is the most important part. <laughs> Dead in the door now, funny. <laughs> All right, let's give him a second before we get cute. He can still get you. Good job, right. brother. Hey, you know giant, but you know what? <laughs> it's his first gator. That's his first gator. And what an experience for all of us. All right, somebody grab the tape. Yep, I got it. I got it. He's still got his reflexes so i mean this is why you tape them up guys because we don't need to lose a foot or a hand or there you go brother that is a nice little gator what a high <laughs> you did it it might be yeah six or seven six or seven hey good job with the dart and the bang stick <laughs> Heck yeah, man. Did it. Good job all around. I'll tell you what, this is a team right here. <laughs> the gators can play football as good as y'all do. Did you hear what he just we said? I wish the gators could play football as good as you guys all. Gator hunt. That was a team, man. That was good Woo. work. Team effort. Hey. 
I will not complain about that. No, I will not. This is the last day until it opens up, what, in October? By then? Oh, uh, September. September, okay. Yep. Oh, it reopens again in September. Yep, just for a month. It's just the makeup period. Oh, good. So you got them right in the spine because ideally they want what right in here? Yeah, right in right there. Right at the base plate. Right so that's there, the, yeah. the head the plate on the skull and that's they want right. you to get it right there and that's what separates the spine from the brain. A lot of guys will hit them right on top of that as well, but sorry he didn't screw up the mount. Didn't mess up the mount. 44 Magnum. Yeah, you didn't wreck the mount. That's true. <laughs> I'm all right. All right, well, we're going to have to get this sucker tagged, baby. Oh, yes. Proud of you, man. That was fun. Thank, Thank you. you so much for letting me come along. Yeah, no problem. Golly, he's beautiful. Wow, that's fun, guys. Well, let's, get, let's get another one. <laughs> <laughs> we're, I think we're just about out of time, man. Yeah. How fun is that? So now he's got to put the tag in it. That's where the money's at? Yeah, that and yeah. just these legs, believe it or not. Now you're going to bring them down and have them processed so there's a place right down the road. He just wants to get them there and so they don't waste any of the meat. I'm guessing seven foot, maybe a little longer, seven three. Seven foot and one half inches. There you go, baby. Seven. Foot. Seven was my minimum. There you go. <laughs> we knew, we knew there was that extra half inch. Good job, guys. Good team effort. I appreciate the invite. Yep. Yeah. Paul, Paul. We learned, yes, sir. Great job, guys. We learned. I wouldn't say we're professionals yet. But we learned. There's only one way to become a professional. You gotta Keep do doing it. it. Keep doing it. Good stuff, man. That's right. You completed right. a bucket list hunt with granddaddy. There you go. That's right. <laughs> That's right. It doesn't get any better than that. Never got yes, to be old. Yes, sir. <laughs> yeah, it's way more fun uh, getting old than it is being old. <laughs> <laughs> and on that note, we're out of here. We'll see you guys in the next one. We're out. <laughs>